Hi guys, welcome to Gizmo Facts. This is Coast of Your Tech Guide. Today I am going to talk about my frustration about Apple products. Sorry, not for all Apple products, but for this product for sure. So this is like the famous Apple Magic Mouse 2, and you could see like how nicely designed it is. You know, a sleek design, smart look, and at the same time very lightweight. Um, I was so excited, you know, the day when I purchased this, and you know, I like returned home and just connected my mouse to my MacBook Pro but the sad part was I could not able to work because my internet was very very much slow at that point of time so I call my service provider to check there if there's something wrong with my internet connection and they checked and they told that you know everything was fine with there is no issues with the internet speed right so I was totally disappointed at that point of time and because I could not able to work with my mouse and even I tested uh, in my another laptop and the speed was same you know the google.com was taking kind of like one minute uh, you know to load the page so it was too much frustrating right can you imagine google.com is taking you know near about one minute to open the page so again you know what I did when I returned home the next very day you know, I was just, you know, quickly in a rush to check my email, okay? And when I just, you know, opened my MacBook Pro and I was checking emails and browsing, you know, a lot of stuff, I found the internet speed was, you know, okay, right? You know, the same, you know, what I usually get, um, which is 45 Mbps of speed and the, and the browsing speed and everything was fine. Then I, you know, what I did, I connect my mouse again suddenly I found there was a huge drop of the internet speed I was like you know oh my god this is this this mouse is causing the issue of the you know internet speed um, then I did my research right and I found yeah so this is the thing you know which is causing the slow much slownessness of my internet connection at my home now the reason being the root cause is this mouse is connected via Bluetooth with my MacBook Pro, right? And Bluetooth is nothing but a peer-to-peer -peer network, as you all know. And that works with 2.4 gigahertz frequency. Now, at that point of time, I was using this router from Netgear uh, at my home. And it is like a single band router, which works with 2.4 gigahertz frequency as well. As a result, what was happening, this was having the Bluetooth and the, my internet connection was having a huge interference of network and the congestion was happening. As a result, the speed was so much slow. It's kind of like 2G speed, which was really, really, very really frustrating. Then what I did, I purchased another router, which is a dual band router. It was big and, you know, having two frequencies. Uh, so it works with two frequencies. One is the 5 gigahertz, another is 2.4 gigahertz. So then after purchasing that new router, I called my service provider, which is the Xfinity Comcast, and uh, they have configured my router with the two, with the two frequencies, 5 gigahertz and 2.4 gigahertz. Thereafter, what I did, I connected all my electronics devices um, at home with the 5 gigahertz frequency, and now you see, everything is fine. You know, there is no lag in the internet connection. I can able to work with my mouse. I am recording my video and consuming a uh, lot of internet um, uh, right now uh, but you know still it's absolutely fine no choppy uh, video streaming no there is no lag and everything is working as expected so this is what like I feel that Apple has to work on this and to rectify this issue for their future releases because it, it it's it's weird I mean how come this Bluetooth you know mouse can cause a slowness, slownessness of a network, right? This is something which Apple has to fix for sure. I hope they will fix for their upcoming releases, uh, right? Yeah, so this is it, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this video. And if you really like this video, then please like and share and subscribe my channel. I'll come up with more technology updates and troubleshooting techniques in my channel, Gizmo Facts. So stay tuned and have a nice week. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.